to leave i didn't vlog my whole work day my apologies but it is 4 53 so i'm almost out of here just found out that some of the staff very very few of the staff will be coming back here on monday i am not thrilled about it i don't know if i can still be as lazy on outfits like that with a couple of people being back but i know there's going to be some managers back and yeah I don't know how I feel about that. Like, I think I have an idea, but I won't know for sure, for sure, until like I'm actually in it. But I hope they don't put them anywhere to sit next to my office. And I hope that they don't try and micromanage me while I'm here. Cause it's been pretty good with them being at home and me just being here, hanging out by myself for the most part. Yeah. We'll see. I try to be nosy, try to look around at the desk to see exactly where they're going to place them, like in their cubicles and stuff, but I wasn't able to tell. And I was going to sneak to another area to see, and then there, the janitor person was there. I'm like, they're going to get like suspicious as to why I'm walking up and down like these empty cubicles, like looking inside of them. So I was like, you know what, let me just not do that, at least not while she was around. Anywho, so I'm almost off of work. Um, I have a Zoom call with some of the members of my bridal party when I get home, so maybe you can sit in on a little bit of it. A portion of the bridesmaids gifts are here. I can't tell you what it is just yet because I don't want to ruin the surprise in case any of them watch. They did mention that, that another half, like half of the order was gonna come on another day. I just remembered that. So I'm gonna open these up, make sure that they're in good condition. And sorry, you guys can't see it yet, maybe closer to the wedding date after they get their gifts, I can show you what I got them. Um, do I need anything special on the day of the bridal shower slash party? What? Bachelorette party slash the, what, wait, what is it? Is it a bridal shower slash bachelor party? Bachelorette party. Yeah. I'm just showing up there. Yeah. <laughs> okay. It's the Thursday. The wedding, the wedding. Um, anything else? No. Cameras. Food. I have my list. And I should have brought it with me, but I left it at work, of course. I'm trying to think if there was something else. Hold on one second. Let me check something. Hold it a minute. Hold it a minute. There's a list here of things they asked us. And I just want to go over to make sure that we have everything. <laughs> okay, so it says we needed to set a budget start a guest list, book the venue, hire a wedding planner, research photographer and videographer, research caterers, throw engagement party, purchase rings, create schedule, print programs, and menu cards. Oh, we need, they didn't even get in touch with me about the bouquets. You are working? I don't want, I don't want bouquets, but. Yeah. No, I'm cool. I have to run back I have to get in touch with them about that. I need to write it down. The bouquets? Yeah, yeah they asked me about it before. Oh. Check with the venue, yeah, I'll check with them. Mail invitation, all that stuff. Book officiant, book photographer, book caterer, research the DJ, 
finalize guest list, choose bridal party, try on dresses, send schedule to vendors, send playlists to band DJ. We need to do that. Purchase bridal party gifts. <laughs> yeah, you gotta save it. But I just I just did research on it and they said that most people don't even care for the favors. They either throw them away or they just leave it there at the venue and they really don't it's whatever they're like you're wasting money buying it so but I am giving you guys your bridal party gifts of course flights and hotel order invitation I think that's pretty much what we have so if you guys can just help me with the sweetheart table idea and I'm gonna look at the hairstyles the hairstyles on Pinterest and stuff. I think that's for the most part we have that and we just need to get our shoes at this point and I think I think we should be good. I wanna get back with you on the hashtag. Yeah. Oh yes and make sure yeah the hashtag too. We need that soon. Within the next two weeks. I'm not a fan of updos. So I want something like all down or most of it down or a wig <laughs> okay. okay well do you guys have any questions for me uh, well I, I, I assume so I think that's usually how it goes but I'm not really supposed to know about it <laughs> I'm just supposed to show up and be great. <laughs> All right, anything else before I let you ladies go? Yes, I'll let you guys know about the rental for the for the um what is that thing called? The rehearsal, <laughs> the rehearsal and and the the actual event. <laughs> I will, I will, I will. And I will see you tomorrow, Kim, bright and early. Okay, I'll text you when I'm on the way. Okay. Alright, guys. Have a good night. I almost went to bed without showing you my bag. Look how cute this is. It says the Mrs. Established 2021. Although technically I was established, or we were established 2020, but the 2020 bag sold out. I am a wedding established bride of 2021. I'm just not a wife established, established bride. Isn't it cute? All black bag, purple glitter. So cute, so I'm storing like all my wedding stuff in here. I'll probably go through and show you the things that are in here as I gather more stuff in the next coming weeks. I'll just put that to hang off of this fan for now. I thought we were all done sending out invitations, but there are two more that needs to go out. They already confirmed that they're coming to the wedding they just need um they just need a physical invitation so that they can give their employers it so they can prove that they're taking time off to go to a wedding and they're not just lollygagging yeah i'm so excited about that so that's what i'll do tomorrow i have four orders that just came through late tonight so um, I'll take that to the, the post office in the morning. Then I have to stop at work to get stamps for the letters. And then I have to go to Kim's house so I can drop off some lingerie. It's not what it sounds like. But one of the things that I got from the store to sell on my website is just not looking that great. Like at all, no matter how many angles I put it at it just looks really bad you can barely tell what it is and it's really cute like it's really cute like on the hanger but like 
I, I just can't get a good picture of it. So I'm gonna take it to Kim's house. She has a mannequin. She says she's gonna help me by putting it on that mannequin. I'm sure it's gonna look a lot better on that mannequin than it does on my floor <laughs> when I'm taking photos. So yeah, I'm gonna take it to her. Then I have to go pick up my contacts and then we have to tackle Jasmine's whole car situation because I already explained that to you in probably another vlog. So yeah gonna be a busy day tomorrow and on top of that I have to do my hair I have I mean it's been such I've already talked about that too how stressful it's been these past few weeks and this is the longest my hair has ever been in a straight state but I either didn't have time to wash and curl it or I didn't have the energy between me crying all the time and me just feeling horrible I just the, my hair was the last thing on my mind so with all of that said I'm gonna go and get me some wine that's also something I've been doing these past few weeks because I've been so stressed out I've been drinking wine and it doesn't help me any except for make me fall asleep for like a good few hours and then I wake up just laying in bed thinking but if I can get some sleep for just a couple of hours so I feel like I've told you way too much in such a short period of time. I'm going to catch you in the vlog tomorrow or in the next clip depending on how I edit this. Bye purpose for now. Love you. Looking good. Face is a little too shiny for my taste though. <laughs> but as we all know the grease always wears off on my face within an hour or two. I'm not too concerned. Um, would you guys like to see my... Bon appetit. I'll never get used to that taste.